Welcome back to Lionfish Layer. Today we will be looking at how you can successfully set up a clownfish aquarium. Clownfish are fascinating little fish, perfect for people at any level of fish keeping. Many people gravitate towards clownfish due to their unique coloration and awesome patterns, as well as being incredibly hardy and pretty easy to look after. The main considerations before purchasing any clownfish are the same as most other fish, tank setup. Ensuring the water parameters, salt water temperature, salinity and pH levels are all correct for your clownfish is of the utmost importance. Typically when you acquire a new fish you need to first cycle the non-reef or reef tank correctly to meet your fish's demands and the same goes with clownfish. So assuming you have completed the nitrogen cycle for your saltwater aquarium we need to consider your clownfish tank setup. In the wild, clownfish will not venture out too far from their home, which is usually a sea anemone located in a shallow reef. When they are in an aquarium environment, they tend to swim up and down more often, but still rarely travel long distances. Nonetheless, clownfish will need a rather modest sized tank, so don't provide a tiny tank when performing the tank setup, just because they aren't particularly mobile fish. Many people say that you can keep a pair of clownfish in a 10 gallon tank, and while somewhat true, I prefer the idea of a 30 gallon tank for two or more clownfish, but 20 gallons is okay. Despite popular belief, large tanks are much easier to look after than smaller ones. Water parameters are much harder to measure and sustain in smaller tanks, not to mention they are more difficult to clean than larger tanks. Clownfish reside in reefs in the wild and therefore will thrive within a reef aquarium environment. So. Try and stock up your tank with some live rock and corals if possible. Clownfish and anemones have a unique and well documented relationship. Whilst clownfish do not need them to survive, they certainly appreciate them, or at least having some spots around the tank to hide. The water you must use for your clownfish aquarium is premium aquarium salt mix. Another recommendation is to purchase a salinity meter too. This way you can constantly measure the salt water quality in your tank. The specific gravity should range between 1.021 and 1.026, which equates to 29 to 35 ppt. These numbers will also be indicated on your salinity meter, should you purchase one. The tank pH level should range between 8.0 and 8.4, no more and certainly no less. The best water temperature for your clownfish should be anywhere between 73 degrees Fahrenheit and 80 degrees Fahrenheit, which equates to 23 degrees Celsius and 27 degrees Celsius. If you can achieve moderate water flow in your aquarium, that would be great for your clownfish too. Fortunately, clownfish are pretty easy to feed as they are far from picky and will eat almost any saltwater fish food, mostly flakes and pellets. It is also important that your clownfish is on a varied and balanced diet, so providing them with mesis shrimp and brine shrimp on occasion is a great idea. You should also feed your clownfish no more than once a day, and I would even suggest to miss a day of feeding perhaps once every two weeks or so to reduce waste in your tank and overfeeding your clownfish. Tank mates are pretty important to get right to ensure your clownfish live a happy and healthy life. Fortunately, I have already created a detailed video on this, so click the video icon on the screen to check it out. And that's the end. Thanks everyone. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe and share for more fish keeping content.